Well, here we are with a Subnautica Below Zero, I'd say flyover walkthrough. I was kind of curious where stuff is, so we're going to ghost around and show everybody real quick. So, this is where you come up. Um, let's get a compass on. So, come up here. This is the Snow Fox base. Get the hover pad. There's a container. I think that has a battery in it. So, when you come out, come down the steps. It's going to be a little laggy because I'm ghosting. All the textures are taking a second to load in. Go over this bridge. This container's got lubricant. Come down. You can check out this one, which we will here in a second, but the second one, second left is where you want to go to find Jeffrey's base. So right over here is Jeffrey's base. Now if we go back, we'll go ahead and go to that other cave. Come in here, and this is, I think there's a mining site in here. Um, yes. So you can go up here and you can actually mine these blue looking chunks two of them up here. There's there's more of them scattered throughout. And if we go out the back door. Okay, so this is on the back side of that. Let me go up. Show you where you started. Started way over there. So, if we go over here to the bridge. Maybe one of the first places you go. I'm not sure how the storyline is going to make us come to this, but follow this up. Uh, cave here in front of us. And if you follow this all the way down, it's going to be kind of dark because I don't have a light and I'm ghosting. Uh, go all the way down to the bottom. Skip that corner. The water should disappear when you're not ghosting, but here's the the frozen Leviathan that you need to get the sample from. And we'll head back out the opposite way. Show you another way of getting in here. Another cave over here. This actual Jeffrey's bunker here. So if you run through Jeffrey's bunker, you can pretty much get to it by going to the left and going in. And then let's head back over where you can see where we're going from. So that's where you, where you're going to start. You're going to come. I think it is this way. Uh, I think this is the mining site again. Yeah. Not the part I wanted to see. Um, stay on the left. You can come over here to another cave. Which has another container. I'm not sure what's in that one. I forget. Uh, there's not a lot in this one. If I remember. Oh, this is the dark cave. That's right. So your flashlight, if you got your flashlight, will make all these glow. And light up the way for you. Not sure we're just gonna s go straight through the wall, get back to where we need to be. All right, so that's the dark cave, and then the large cave is my favorite. 
out here. That's back down to the uh, frozen Leviathan. Next uh, up now. Okay. Jeffrey's base. And here we go. This is my favorite. So basically... Almost... Straight north, one... One click... One little check, if you see your compass at the top, but it's like one mark off of due north. So you'll be going... What is it? North... Northwest slightly? Yeah, one check north northwest, and that will bring you to the glacial basin large cave. This one will let me slow down a little. This cave is huge, and it is beautiful. They did a nice job here. bit faster. Oh, it makes me lag when I go too quick. Coasting. But yeah, this is the large cave. Basically, it looks like it does one big circle. And you got fragments everywhere. Um... There's a fragment. Another fragment. Like anywhere you're, anywhere near these snow stalkers is probably going to be fragments because I think they destroyed the snow boxes. And one more cool little cave over here. If we can find it. There is a... There's a mama and two, three, uh, ah, we missed it. Now, somewhere over here is a mama and three babies. No stalkers. It's not an important, I think I've, did I go through it already? Yeah, it's right here. Must have went through it and not even paid any attention. Yeah. Cute little things. Uh, if you liked the video, hit that like and subscribe. I hope it helps people that were questioning where to find stuff. I know I didn't go in depth. I don't want to spoil all of your fun. But for the most part, you can. You can see most of the stuff that you need from just ghosting straight up. Best bet is to explore. Enjoy the game. It's such a great game. Or going to be such a great game. It's pretty damn great right at the moment, but I can only imagine what it's going to be at the end. Well, y'all have a good one. We'll see you on the next.